that involved seven different cables. Oh, oh man, <laughs> that was rough. A, a big heavyweight screen is now built into this. This is your entire computer. That big, huge box that we used to sit on the floor yes. has been scaled down and it's now inside of this. I get to reintroduce you to Kat. Welcome. How are you? Yes, how are you doing? Thank uh, you. I'm Kat great. is our, our representative from Dell, Kat Genesco. Uh, we make these available in all white and also yes. in all black. All those cables that were a little frustrating and a little confusing because you had to get them right, those have all been done away with. You now have a wireless keyboard, which I can take up to 20 feet away from yes. my new all in one, which Absolutely. means I can sit on the couch and do my typing. Yep. There's my wireless mouse. Even the batteries for these yeah. come included. Then we have a piece of equipment that has absolutely one cord. And that cord is the power cord that goes into the outlet to give you power. Pretty cool. I love that. I do too. It's so easy. The specs on this are very impressive. Mm -hmm. Yep, it, Intel it, processor. It starts with this screen. That's the biggest touch screen that Touch. we've ever done in a home office all in one. It's also a terabyte hard drive for storage, eight gigabytes of random access memory, which by the way is the most we've ever done as well. Mm -hmm. uh, I have an all in one at home, four gigs. And four yes. gigs is still standard in the industry. It is. For desktops. They've doubled it. By the way, eight gigs is the most that could be put into this piece of equipment yeah. for right now. Exactly. And then you're also going to get an Intel quad core processor and the price tag, the price tag is less than 700 bucks. The software we're giving people is valued at more than what we're charging for the computer and the software. Correct. That's correct. So here's the choice you'll need to make. Do I want the white or do I want the black? And then am I willing to spend $50 more to pick up the Microsoft Office 365 personal? Yes. Uh, yeah. I would <laughs> recommend it. Yeah because that's going to be your word processing for Word. That's going to be your Excel for your spreadsheets, PowerPoint for your presentations, mm -hmm. OneNote, also gives you Skype with yep. 60 minutes of free talk minutes on Skype, then also provides you with what's called uh, the OneCloud, which is an, another terabyte of, star, of storage yes. for cloud-based. So that's the extra 50 bucks. It breaks down with free shipping and handling. That's $25 that you don't have to pay. And the computer will arrive in about seven to 10 days. You're saving a tank of gas. <laughs> yeah, 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 you, you are. are. Then the software, this is a part that really got me excited because we're offering premier PC tech support for as long as you own your computer. Any questions you have are answered by someone here in North America and they're there to serve you. We then give you two different manipulation software programs for high definition video and for photographs. The File Center professional version just keeps you better organized. Laplink PC Mover Pro yep. is that software that negates the frustration of how do I get things off my old computer and get them on my brand new Dell? Yes. That's the software that'll do it for you. Oh, it, you would normally have to pay hundreds of extra dollars for services like this. Because of our relationship with QVC, you guys yeah. were our first retail partner ever. Seven, 17 we, years 17 ago. 17 years ago. And we've been married to you for that long. We've not only been able to give you an all-in-one desktop that takes one single cord to set up yeah. with all of the power and all of the memory, but we've been able to give you that software service and support included with your computer. That's uh, a big deal. It is. Uh, the software value, again, is over $814. One of the software packages that we include and I, I can't take all the credit for it, but I was certainly asking for it to be included, is something called Dragon Naturally Speak. Right. And it's their, their 10th, uh, pardon me, their 13th evolution of this. Uh, Dragon Naturally Speak allows you to talk when you're sitting at your desk. The microphone built into your computer mm -hmm. picks up your voice. It actually learns who you are. Because, you know, if you grew up in Dallas, Texas, you sound a little bit different than somebody who grew up in Vermont. Yes. It re recognizes your dialect, it learns your speech pattern, and it types out what you wish to say. It's absolutely amazing. First time I saw it, I thought it was a magic trick. It, it's just you're talking to your computer. But you can interact your with your computer uh, with no hands at all. People who are mm -hmm. handicapped and handy capable right. love it. 
it is just another value added piece for you in a computer that already is chock full. Windows 10. Yep. Windows 10 was built for touch. It was, and, and I will tell you, we met them two and a half years ago when we did the Windows, the world premiere launch uh -huh. of Windows 10 live here on QVC. We met with the Microsoft team and they said, you guys, we just want to let you know, don't let any, don't tell anybody there's a Windows 10 and a half. We don't plan on that. Right. There's no Windows 11 because this is truly the best of Windows 8.1 and the best of Windows 7. All that you've loved in both operating systems, they've put it into one operating system. Thus, you have Windows 10. And it works so well. It does. When you've got this bigger screen. Oh, I So love look it. how beautiful that screen is. Mm -hmm. It's high definition. Uh, they have great audio as well. But that, that touch screen is how you will interact with your computer every day. And Kat, I've got to admit this happens to me, I'd say probably four out of five days a week because I work with a touch screen at home. Yeah. And I'm so now accustomed to it. It's like working with a gigantic cell phone. Right. Because we're used to that with our, our well, iPhones, is, et cetera, et cetera. Well, this is my cell phone. Yeah, and you've got a big phone. I have a huge phone. Yeah. It's, it's a brick. I, I come to work and sit down at my desk and reach up and touch the screen. Oh, and yeah. I go, oh, yeah, that's right. Nothing happens because I don't have touch screen here at the office. I love having touch screen. And I love, I was. Once you have touch screen, you don't want to go back to a regular computer. Yes. Because you're so much faster. We're so used to swiping for photographs and enlarging and doing this and doing that. And this computer was built to be able to do that with a processor that's a quad core processor yes. that was built specifically for this computer by the folks who are the biggest leaders in processing manufacturing. Intel, yes. It is an Intel quad core processor. And a lot of times people have the question, okay, so I have a dual core processor, what's the difference? Well, a quad core processor versus a dual core actually opens up two more lanes of traffic okay. for information to flow through. Think of it as like you're at the grocery store and there's like one lane open. How many times has that happened to me? Every time I go to the grocery store, it's so frustrating. You don't want to have to wait. You don't want the lag time. Uh -huh. You're not going to get that on your computer because you have the quad core processor and with eight gigs the, of memory. I don't know the algorithms, but it's exponentially faster. So it is. A, a dual core processor isn't just half as slow as a quad. The quad core is going to be many, many times faster. Mm -hmm. So quad core processor means that you don't wait. You then also build into it eight gigs of random access memory and yeah. now you're not waiting at all because there's no hourglass to worry about. Your random access memory is what allows you to do several things at one time. How right many here, things do you have uh, up? Oh gosh, one, what two, do count? three, like four, five, 10, 14 right now, 14? Okay. Actually, I think I have more. Oh wow, I have probably 20. That's a lot. And we're talking about, this we've is... got high definition video running in the background. Yes. Uh, that's what random access memory allows you to do. If you split screen, I happen to, when I work at home, yes, I have, I screen. use two monitors because it just helps me to. Well, can I show you how you do split screen? Sure. Okay. So if you notice, I have my photos up over here uh -huh. and then I have something else over here. So I can actually Control. do the windows button. Yep. So the windows button on your keyboard, I'm just going to lift it up here. It's right down here. So that's your Windows button, then go ahead and press one of those right. left and or right you arrows. Any one of any these one of those. arrows, yep. and it'll split, split uh, screen for yeah. you. Yeah, so if I have, like, say I have my photos open, I'm just going to maximize this. Right. Go ahead and hit that right arrow key. There we go. That's going to bring up all of the programs that I have up and running on my computer. And I'm telling you, this is like way more programs than you would normally have open every day. This is, if you spend the, the $50 to get Word, this could be typing up a homework assignment exactly. here. Exactly, and Researching. your encyclopedia. Do they still have encyclopedias? I think I, they do. I guess so, online. What's That's it? what I'm saying, you, yeah. need, you yeah. need the power because everything is online these days. Uh, so split screen is the way to go and it, it all just works. And your touch screen works. Now, by the way, on this, your keyboard is still a full functioning keyboard. Yes. It's just now wireless. You don't need the cord anymore. As is your mouse. And I will tell you, when you get this in the mail, there's going to be a little, a lot of people have the question, okay, so how do I connect the wire? You know, there's the next thing. It's a okay. not difficult at all. You will see a little piece in the box that this computer comes in that oh. is called a dongle. So if I remove this, I'm just going to take it out to show you guys. Right. This is what that piece looks like. It's just a little piece, and you pop it into one of your USB ports on your computer. And there's four USB ports. Four in total. So two on the side of the computer, on the left-hand side uh -huh. of the computer, and then you have two in the back as well. And we can go over all that, too. Uh, you the you tour. want to take a little tour? Let's take Let's a tour. Okay. Why not? Let's start off with your keyboard is a full keyboard. Mm -hmm. 
And it's a, a not only a QWERTY keyboard, but it's also a numeric keypad. I love that. So if you do any accounting, it just makes it simpler mm -hmm. other than just having your numerical keys up at the top. So th it's duplicated. You then also have your control keys right here in the middle. Yep. So you've got your print, you've got your, your scrolling keys, your delete and page up and down, directional keys, numerical lock. It, it really is a full function keyboard in every way. And the batteries come with both the mouse, mouse and Great. the keyboard. So it's already in the box for you. Oh, don't have and to get uh, batteries. do me a favor, grab that one down there. Sure. Uh, it, you have a color choice. If you go mm -hmm. black, you get the black. If you go white, you get the white. So it's just clean, crisp, and really well done. I love it. Now, it is a desktop computer, but it's probably the most portable desktop computer that we have ever made available with the biggest screen that we have definitely ever made available. Oh, 24 inch high definition display. Yeah. I mean, that is, and it's just edge to edge, beautiful quality glass. That's the one thing I love about working for Dell is that we've invested it. I've learned all this stuff. We've invested in what's called premium glass on our monitors, and that's what makes us number one in the monitor game. Uh, th there's another factor. Touch screen has gone through as many evolutions as computers. Yes, definitely. Windows 10 was built for touch screen. But there are still touch screens out there that are slow because there are remote sensors, cameras, that are built into the screen that have to somewhat forecast what it is you're going to touch. Mm -hmm. Dell started this technology. They're the ones who created it and their touch is immediate. There's nothing more frustrating with touch than if there's a lag. Oh my and, gosh. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, and you're like, yeah, keep yeah, tapping yeah. it, like something please happen. There's no lag yeah. here, and part of that is also because of the, the internal working of the computer. Right. But all these things that you do with your big cell phones, you now do on your computer. Yep. Exactly, and, it's, and that is what, you know, of course, if you press your Windows button down here, this kind of resembles, I'm just gonna click it on my keyboard, but this resembles your cell phone right here with sure. all of those what are called live tiles. Uh -huh. So there's the screen, and guess what? You even have a high definition web camera built into this computer. With audio. With audio. Now, I know that sounds redundant, but no. at this price point, there are computers out there that don't have high definition cameras, or if they have a camera, they don't have audio. What's right. the sense of me talking to my little, you know, two-year-old granddaughter if I can't hear the giggle that I'm seeing? Well, I know this isn't Toto, but... All right, close enough. Does that sound like you two, kind of? Yeah. It's not. This, it's not you There's two. a speaker system down at the bottom not now. that goes from edge to edge. You do have the ability to put remote speakers on it if you choose to. Yes. But you don't have to. Well, you don't have to. I mean, these are, no, these speakers are awesome, I'm telling and you. Audio with the computer, as far as I'm concerned, is a necessity. Well, because this does essentially become your entertainment hub. We do have a little dorm room right. set up over right. here, we'll show you. But this does become your entertainment hub when you're watching movies with the kids. Maybe you have your Netflix or your Hulu. You can do that on here. But again, I can't stress this enough. Look how sleek and chic this is with one single cord to set up the entire. That's like, insane. that's a lot of power that's in this computer. You would think there's more man work that goes into Go, right. actually setting it up when you get it at your doorstep. There's just not. And, and because you get in this tiny, well, I say tiny, it's a big screen, yeah. but a really slender package, you get a terabyte hard drive, you've got enough storage space for the future. A terabyte hard drive means that you can store half a million songs. Russ. That's, that's great. It is. Ha half a million photos, high definition. high definition photos, 250,000 songs. Do you know that many Toto songs? Uh, I don't think they no, ever written, I, I don't I even think this, they've ever written that many. I repeat the same seven over and over. Yes, you do. 250,000 <laughs> I love times. that. I love that. But then, of course, you have 100 high definition <laughs> videos. And obviously, I'm going to need a lot of that for my dog videos. You will. And we, when did you, yes. it was last night at midnight, was that the first time that you broke out the photos I, of George? I think I actually, this was his debut on QVC. With Rick? This was his QVC debut. So he's a Boston Terrier? He's a, bo his ears have not popped up yet. They okay. will. They will. But this is, I visited him a couple weeks ago. You can tell the Boston Terriers by the accent. Oh, <laughs> yeah, they do. Fuck. Yes, Fuck. They do have an accent. <laughs> oh, I love it. He's really cute. Is this your first puppy as an adult? No, I've had puppies in the past. Okay. But this is, um, he's such an age. I just love them all. I wish I could take all the dogs in the world and just house them all, but I can't. How, you know? how old was he in that photograph? He is, oh, he's almost eight weeks. He'll be eight weeks on July 24th. Okay. I know he's like a child to me. No, he, and he'll change your he life. Really, there he is. It's, just, it's the greatest thing. But these are the he'll photos I saw. This is actually from my cell phone, and I transferred it onto my computer, which is why you see the column here. But 
I'm going to need a ton of space for this. And, and this is and way more than I would need. I'm telling you, I, I applaud you. I like the name. George, thank That's you. That's a good name I for a I think it's a great Terrier. name. I think it's a good one. It's, it's you know. <laughs> you did good. He's an old man. That's all. You did good. Yeah, I love it. Screen's amazing.